welcome back to my channel. So this is my first video in our new home. Um, this is gonna be the new space. I'm sorry if it's echoey right now. I hope it's not too bad, but anyway, today I'm gonna be doing a basics haul. I don't ever think that I've done a basics haul, and this is in partnership with Everlane. Some of you guys may already be familiar with Everlane. I'm wearing their pieces right here and I love them. You guys are going to love them. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Everlane and why I got these pieces. So if you're interested in this video, please stay tuned. As always, don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave and also follow me on Instagram. I'm at Naomi Boyer if you want daily outfit inspiration. Without further ado, let's get to the video. All right, so this is a basics haul. I mentioned that already before. Um, just wanted to let you guys know, side note about basics, um, about my thoughts on them. I talk a lot about basics in this channel because they're such a necessity. They're things that you need in your closet. If you are finding that you don't have anything to wear, it's probably because you don't have enough basics and enough good basics. Um, so I have a lot of items on here that you may think look the same, but I promise you they're all different and there's always a different reason why I need something that looks similar to the other, but still different, if you get what I'm saying. And another thing, this basics haul, I went for pieces that are basics, but I also went for some color. A lot of them are black and white pieces and then I strayed away from that and did some summer colors. And just to show you guys how you can make basics cute. Basics don't have to be boring. All right, so starting off with this button down, I love this color. It's like a pale yellow. You guys know I don't love to do so much bright crazy colors, but I love like neutral types of colors and softer colors. So this is right up my alley. I had to get it. I don't have anything like this in my closet. This yellow just makes me feel happy. Um, let me untuck it to show you guys. So it is a linen material. It's going to be super breathable. I just kind of folded the sleeves up right here. For me, I like to wear button down shirts like this more in a casual way. So I will leave it unbuttoned pretty low. And a couple different ways you can wear this. You can wear it like how I'm wearing, just really casually. But these types of shirts are also really nice for beach cover-ups. And again, you can also wear these shirts to work. So super versatile. You can wear them from day to night, dressy or casual. And even though it's pretty long, I still am able to tuck it into these shorts which are also by Everlane. Just do the little French tuck right there. And this is literally how I go out and about. And I got a size zero in this top. And then moving on to these shorts, I'm gonna tell you guys, right now, you need these shorts. And I think the pockets being right here make the shorts really, really cute. Kind of gives me like almost a 70s vibe in a way. Um, but these ones I got in a size zero. The pockets are in the front. There will not be any pockets in the back. They're just made really well, really nice structure. All right, you guys, so next up, I got the same shirt in the lavender color because this is the color of the summer. Um, I just really love how soft the color is. Again, just paired it with the same shorts that I wore with the yellow top. Um, these two colors together are just really pretty to look at, nice on the eyes. Um, I don't know if I ever showed you a close-up of this top, kind of have the collar up a little bit. I also like that look. So this is what it looks like up close. And then again, you can use this top in so many different ways. Pair them with a bunch of different bottoms. This color would also look really pretty with some like white wide leg longer pants um, or even some white trousers if you want to kind of dress it up a little bit more. And then of course, denim. All right, next up, I have this blush pink hoodie. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of hoodies, but when they're made like this, I feel like they're a little more, I don't know how to describe it, a little more dressy, I guess, not as frumpy or casual. Like, I feel like this is a hoodie that's meant to wear out and to look nice in. Um, number one, because of the slim fit. Let me just untuck the bottom. Kind of make it shorter if you want, but also the length is just perfect. It has these kind of like pockets on the side. It's super soft, 
really comfortable and I like that this part here is white as well and I like how the hood just kind of gathers around my neck like that so this is something that you could just throw on if you need to run an errand if you're gonna go and take a nice stroll along the beach something nice to just throw on over your workout clothes or pairing this with some jeans and boots going to look really cute as well so if you're looking for a hoodie that doesn't look so like sweats type of hoodie um, you'll really like this and again there are a bunch of different colors so with everything that I will be showing you and with everything that I have showed you guys um, there are a ton of different color options which is great and I'll also have direct links for you guys to shop down in the description box below so be sure to check that out this one I also got in a size extra small all right, next up I have this sweater. I know it's a sweater, but it still gets pretty chilly um, at nights here in LA. Um, but look at this color. How pretty is this color? And you guys, I love this neckline. I just love everything about this sweater. I can just throw it on at night. It looks great with these shorts. Um, but this color was what made me just kind of drawn to it and I had to have it. Um, it's really, really soft and it just looks like a really nice sweater um, this one I just got in an extra small again this is something I would definitely wear to work um, with some trousers some slacks and then just because the color is so fun you can definitely wear this in so many fun different ways you know wear monotone maybe with some pink pants this would look really cute with like a satin mini skirt all right you guys so next up we have this poplin shirt so I have button downs but I don't have a poplin button down that kind of looks like you're wearing your boyfriend or your husband's button down. Um, but I think that every woman needs something like this in their closet. So right now I'm just pairing it with some shorts, wearing it super casually. These shorts are also from Everlane, um, but let's just talk about this poplin top. I think right away you can already see the structure and how just like nice and clean and crisp and like perfect of a poplin shirt it looks like. So I just pulled the sleeves back and I just love how it gathers just like that and it's kind of loose. I just feel like this look is really, really chic, even though it is a bit oversized. This is something you guys are going to have in your closet forever. And again, this is a super versatile top. You can wear it like how I'm wearing it. You can wear it with jeans, long jeans, um, trousers and pants for work, obviously. This would also look really cute as a cover up to the beach unbuttoned. So you're going to get so much use out of this shirt. The material is really nice. It's not too heavy, not too thick. It's perfect. Um, this one I got in a size zero. Also wanted to show you guys how long um, this poplin top is on me. Um, so if I wanted to, I could also wear it with a black mini skirt underneath it and kind of belt it so that it's kind of like a dress, but I'm still secure that I'm wearing something underneath. That look will also look good with some black biker shorts. You can tuck this into a mini skirt. So, so many cute and different ways you can wear this top. Maybe I should do a video on it. All right, moving on to these shorts. So obviously denim shorts, there is stretch to them. So you're not gonna feel like constricted or like you can't move. And then this is just what the back of these shorts look like. This one I got a size 24 in. The wash is pretty darn perfect. It's gonna go with pretty much everything. It has a raw hem, which is nice. So it's gonna be a little bit edgy. All right, next up I have this monochrome outfit, kind of like a peachy orange color. So obviously top and bottom are from Everlane. They are two separates. Now I wanted to show you this top. It feels like a silk top. I'm not sure if it's 100% silk. It feels like it though. It's really nice. It just lays really nicely on your body. Perfect fit. Um, it's not too wide or it's not going to make you look too frumpy. Now this one again is just something nice to kind of throw on with jeans when you're out and about. Just throw on some flats and you're good to go. So if you're the kind of person that loves ease and just wants to look nice without just trying so hard and just effortless, you're gonna love this shirt. 
It comes in so many cute different colors as well. And it's just so soft and comfortable, almost like you're wearing nothing. Again, you can wear this casually. You could wear this top to work. It's just a versatile shirt again. Um, and then similar to like the poplin shirt I just showed you, um, this one obviously is shorter sleeves. So perfect if you like that look. Um, but then again, we're going in summer months and it's gonna get warmer and warmer. So this may be your answer to that. And then these shorts, I showed you guys, I have the cream version of them. Again, super soft, super versatile. I just love this color. Don't have anything like this in my closet again, but this color is really pretty. It's gonna look really nice with other whites and creams for tops. Again, I could just pair this with like a white sweater. Um, delicate, nice white blouses are gonna look really nice with these shorts. All right, you guys, moving on. Um, I got this top that I absolutely love. I got it in both this color, a white, and also in a black. Because I feel like black and white are the two colors that we feel like we need the most or that we gravitate towards um, when it comes to basics. And so this one I don't have in my closet and I felt like I just needed it. Um, obviously you can tell by the shoulders that it's a pretty square top and then when I just put my arms down it kind of looks like a cap sleeve. The great thing about this top is that you can wear it super casual or you can really dress it up. Because of the material, it's like a silky material, the pockets there kind of makes it casual but then again this shirt is still just super wearable for both day and night and dressing casual. So I have it just kind of out like this but obviously I love to tuck everything in. So I just wanna show you guys what it would look like if I did tuck it in. So just like this, super casual vibe, cool and effortless. And I wanted to show you guys these jeans because yes, they are also from Everlane and they do carry jeans and I was super skeptical about it, but I had to try. It looked great on the model and oh my gosh, can't even begin to tell you how great these jeans are. Number one, comfort. When you find jeans that fit you well, that kind of make you feel like you're wearing leggings, but you're not, I think that's a win-win. Um, so these are what the back of the jeans look like. Again, just like the shorts, the pocket size is perfect. This one I believe is called the Cheeky Straight. It kind of reminds me of like a mom jean, which I've been really into. I feel like it just gives your body a really nice shape. So here's kind of the trick with basics. If you have good ones that fit you well, you're gonna look good. Um, and it doesn't have to be anything with print or crazy. Like you could just wear a simple white top and jeans. And I just feel like as long as they're good and as long as they fit you well, um, and maybe even depends on some materials, like this is more of a silky material paired with jeans. So you have kind of your fancy-ish and then your casual kind of balance each other out. Um, then you just kind of feel nice. You feel like you can go about your day, not too dressy, but you're also like dressed up at the same time, if you know what I mean. And if that wasn't enough, they do have shoes as well. Um, I will tell you that these are extremely comfortable. There is a lot of padding in these flat sandals and I don't have red ones, but I loved how these looked because I feel like they look like all the popular little kitten heels that I'm seeing out there, except in a flat. So I just had to get them. They have a ton of different um, colors and similar sandals on their site that you can shop from as well. All right, I just wanted to show you guys, this is the same shirt, um, just in black. Again, another key to dressing up super casual basic outfits is to just add some jewelry, however simple or crazy you wanna go always helps. I just have some hoops and a necklace. Um, I could throw on a black leather jacket with this or a denim jacket, and it's just such a cool girl type of vibe. All right, next up, I'm sure you guys are wondering if I had like t-shirts and things like that, and I do. Um, so let's start off with this blush pink, I think they might call it rose colored um, t-shirt, which I'm super ecstatic about. I mean, look at the fit. Um, I got one with a pocket. Now, the great thing about Everlane is that they have a whole variety of different kinds of t-shirts. Whether you like a wider fit, um, whether you like a true, like, slimmer fit like I do, um, whether you like the pockets or without the pockets, they have a t-shirt 
for everyone um, and every style that you're looking for. I got one of these with the pockets just to see how it would look and feel. Um, it's not too crazy. I wasn't really sure if I like t-shirts with pockets, but they do kind of bring something more to a plain t-shirt. So if you're not one that is really comfortable just wearing a plain t-shirt just because it's so plain, you might like the t-shirts with the pockets. Again, they come in a variety of different colors, which is great. Obviously a t-shirt like this is super necessary. Um, I would definitely wear this under a blazer with jeans and then that's a really cool look again Obviously by itself just like how I'm wearing it with these jeans Everyone just needs a good t-shirt and then it's really comfortable There is still room to fold the sleeves if you wanted to like I have here so you can see the difference um, And it feels really sturdy and structured really well all right, next up Obviously I had to get a plain white t-shirt. I also got this one in black just to show you guys lengthwise, I got an extra small, super soft, super comfortable, not like so heavy. Again, love the neckline. Here's how it would look with a French tuck. So a t-shirt like this is necessary. You need t-shirts like this in your closet, especially if you want to throw a jacket over it. Whether it's a fancy type of jacket, like a blazer, um, or it's a leather jacket, or whatever type of jacket, a t-shirt is always something that you can easily throw underneath anything like that and you're good to go. It's just an everyday essential and then again, when you find a good one that fits you right, you can always wear it alone and it'll just look nice on its own. All right, so here's the black version of it. If you're one of those people that wants more of a slouchy neckline or a V neckline, they have those as well. All right, creeping up towards the end here. So I have this muscle tank and I love muscle tanks because of the width. Um, right here from neck to shoulder. It pretty much covers it um, And I feel like they just give it a different look as opposed to just wearing like a tank top But when it comes to layering um, Like I mentioned earlier if you want to throw on any type of jacket Sometimes you're not gonna want to wear a full-on t-shirt underneath um, Sometimes the t-shirt just may be a little too hot So tanks like this are necessary in your closet for those reasons as well so for something heavy like a leather jacket, this is going to be nice to wear underneath it. And again, it's just a basic style of top that you need. And again, crew neck, um, same material as the t-shirt that I just showed you guys, super soft and comfortable. And this is also similar to the silky version that I showed you guys earlier that had the pocket. But then again, the reason why I got these two was because of the two different materials. So when you have a more cotton casual material tank like this, there are gonna be days where you're gonna wanna feel like you need more of a cotton tank instead of a more fancy silky tank because maybe you're gonna wear it with a more casual look versus the other tank that looks like this except it's silky, that one you may find yourself gravitating towards that when you want to dress up a bit more. All right, last but not least, um, this one is a little bit more relaxed. This is also a different material that I had to try for variety purposes. This is more of a linen material. Neckline is not as crew as the other ones that I just showed you. But then again, you're going to find or have days where you're going to want to show more skin in this region. And they do have those options as well. Um, but there are also going to be days when you're going to want a thinner strap. Like the one I just showed you, the muscle tank was a little bit thicker. This one is a little bit thinner. So for some days and some reasons that you may have, um, this is the type of tank that you're going to want. So, so this is why it's kind of important to have different materials, different types of tanks and t-shirts because you're always gonna have a reason why you need them. And then also they do have camisoles on the site if you want straps that are, again, spaghetti strap thin. Again, these ones come in a variety of colors. Um, this one, again, is super comfortable, super soft, really breathable, perfect for the warmer months to come. And yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching, spending your time with me. I hope you liked this basics video and found it useful. If you did, comment down below and give me a thumbs up. 
Thank you to Everlane for partnering up with me to do this video. Everything I mentioned, everything I talked about and showed you guys um, will be linked in the description box below for you guys to shop. So be sure to check those out. And don't forget before you leave, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. I'm at Naomi Boyer. Again, thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video.